I'll do another one before I go to sleep, and then I'll wake up and start all over again. My 25-year-old son, Stephen, is a heroin addict, and I'm afraid he's gonna die. My husband, Rich, and I have been enabling Stephen all along. I am so angry at him. <laughs> how dare he do this to himself, and how dare he do this to us? You have got to take the blinders off and say, my child is killing himself. I'm gonna be coming up with my guy here in a couple minutes. Uh, I'd prefer if you'd turn the camera off so uh, I can go do this. I just got back, that's what I got. Do you have any remorse for what you've done to yourself and what you've done to your family? Not so much to myself, but my family, yeah. <laughs> I don't know who you are. I miss that person so much. Are you willing to immerse yourself in a major treatment program? Absolutely. Well, joining us is Stephen, his mother, Linda, and his father, Rich. And I am proud to say Stephen is not one, not two, not three, not four, but five years sober as he sits here today. And, um, <clears throat> that takes a lot of hard work and a lot of resolve, and I am so proud of you as you sit Thank here you today. Thank you I truly am. How are you guys Awesome. Doing? Compared to that? <laughs> yeah. That was, a, that was a long and hard day, right? It was the hardest day of, of my life, I think, our, all of our yeah. lives, yes, absolutely. Right. And really because I, I sensed at the time that you guys were experiencing not only fear, but a helplessness about it. It's like, I'm scared of what's going on, but I feel helpless to do anything about it. Is, yeah, would that be fair? Right. Yeah, we were, we were enabling them. You know, we, we knew we were. And we'd stop for a while, but we, we were still doing it. We were letting him living in our house and without any rent. So basically, we we're letting him do it in our house. Yeah. And it just, it was hard to stop. Well, he's your son, and he's yeah. charming, and he was very manipulative. Mm -hmm. But you said when you got here, you didn't even try to manipulate the staff. Why? I mean, I wasn't going to come here unless I wanted to get help. Yeah. Like, I mean, I wasn't here to try and manipulate anybody. It wasn't here to try and hurt anybody else here because I had nowhere else to go when I needed to go to treatment. Yeah. I watched you when your mother and father were experiencing so much pain and that you were causing, and that was not okay with you. I could see in your eyes it was not okay for you to see them hurting and know that you caused that. I mean, I still haven't watched the show. So like seeing that was actually the first time that I've seen it. Really? And like, it's still not. You see them now smiling, you see them happy. I mean, it's a, it's a little different picture, right? Just a little bit. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, you said I was the first person that offered you treatment, but didn't demand it from you. It gave you the choice so you could own it. Why was that important to you? Because I'm stubborn. I just am like even my parents would try and get me to go do things and like that kind of stuff and if somebody tells me to do something I'm just gonna say no it's just like first instinct so like yeah. to have somebody offer it to me and be like you know if you want to for some reason it worked I have no idea I think I said at the time I wanted to do this with you not right. to you and you said that at this point your son is honest and honorable the kind of human being that he was before. Oh, absolutely. That he's come back to what you had raised and what you knew before, he's true? He's better. Even better, huh? He's yeah. better. So he's matured into it? Very yeah. much so. <clears throat> so I'm guessing you guys are glad you came. <laughs> <laughs> Beyond glad yeah. and, and grateful. You know, it is a trade-off. You know, you say thank you, and I thank you for saying that because for us, every guest is a teaching tool. Just think there are millions and millions of people that watch this show every day. So it's not just what happens here, but you changed a lot of lives by allowing yourself to be here and do that. So you're paying it forward from the minute that you get here. So you, you thank us, let me thank you for being willing to come here and do it as well. <laughs>